Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Scorpio Sun, Scorpio Moon and Scorpio Rising weekly tarot reading July 16th to July 22nd 2018. So let's see what we do have for us guys, for us Scorpios and the first card that expresses up the topic of our week is going to be the Page of Swords. <clears throat> Afterwards we do have the core of the situation which does point to Ace of Cups, that's interesting. Then we do have the challenges that we need to stand against, that will be the Queen of Swords. And the last one is shows up the Guidance, that will be the Seven of Swords. So we do have a conflict arising here, Scorpios. A conflict which is typical uh, of uh, for teenagers, for example. Uh, I, I will try to give it that particular example. Let's say that you are a teenager and you recently crushed on a specific girl or on a specific boy and everything goes great you know I mean you like each other you hang out but one day you decide to invite that person at home your parents sees it and they say no I don't want to see that person anymore I don't want you to be involved with that girl or with that guy this is the kind of a conflict we're talking about that you will have to um, that you will have to face and when we talk about that kind of a conflict that could be as well a third party into one romantic relationship you may fall in love with someone else you know outside of your relationship or it's just you you, you can have the thing for that person you know and yet you could be uh, involved into either uh, you know uh, a slowly uh, deteriorating relationship because it's not going to be going great you know because I do have that uh, statement here that if you have an eyes for someone else obviously something is wrong into your into your particular relationship the bottom line here is what's going what's going to happen here guys is that we do have the ace of cups which is a, a new happy circumstances that are that that will happen to us ace of cups in a core situation plays a role of like a a very um Fateful events which are happening, surprisingly happens, which are making our ongoing issues, our ongoing, uh, you know, troubles or kind of worries totally irrelevant. So, for example, if you are worrying that you are single, well, that week is going to present you with the opportunity to make those worries totally irrelevant for your future. So, in other words, you are going to meet someone that you both will have the thing to one another. The problem is that that thing that you will have to worry one another is going to be a problem for someone who still have control upon your life all right and if we're talking about career here then pro then that could be that you are siding with someone at your work and this kind of like it is not liked by by your boss and they don't want you to work together something like this so uh, as a challenging position the queen of uh, swords it is very difficult card to be overcome because the queen of swords usually as a person uh, plays a role of that she or he has the leverages or in other words they have you uh, they have you cornered I mean they can pull strings they can uh, they know how to press buttons etc etc and uh, <clears throat> this will not go away without any conflicts here but that is displayed with the seven of swords so you Scorpio whenever that thing happened and whenever someone tries to take it from you this is the time where you have to stand for your personal rights because the seven of swords as a guidance is that standing for your personal rights and uh, making uh, making it obvious you know that you are not someone who can be toyed with and you are not someone who uh, can be told what to do if there is nothing in it for you all right and that you are ready to um, embark your personal agenda because the agenda that you are following right now does not serve you a, a specifically good um, purposes but let's talk about this new person that you may uh, engage during that week. Page of uh, Swords. Around your age, maybe a little bit younger, uh, that person is quite of a um, independable thinker. So it, it doesn't matter, uh, are you going to have a synergy in between you and, uh, and, and him, or kind of like in between you and her, all right, uh, in, um, in interests. 
uh, even if you like different things they are uh, their mind is quite broad to uh, understand you and to accept you for who you are so I can advise you here guys to really um, kind of like give it a go give it a try despite the opposition because for what it seems that could really be the relationship you have been waiting for so that being said Scorpios this was your weekly tarot reading for you July 16th to July 22nd 2018 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video Rod signing out now see you next time bye